Rise of Skywalker prequel proves Rey is a better Jedi than Anakin or Luke. What? Oh man, shut the... What's up, geeks and gamers? It's your boy, Drunk3PO, and... Oh, I was sent this article. Sorry. <laughs> I was sent this article, and I was like, you've got to be kidding me. I ain't kidding you. This is about a comic book. A comic book that prequels the rise of Skywalker. A comic book. And basically what it says in the comic book, well, spoiler alert. Okay. Basically what it says in the comic book is that Luke had a mentor and had training. Ha <laughs> ha. Imagine that. Anakin had the whole Jedi Council training. He also had the Emperor's training. And he had all these people behind him. That's what made him so powerful. And Rey didn't have anything. And because she didn't have any training or any mentor, she was still able to defeat Force users and other things uh, by herself. She was a one-woman army, as the comic book says. Well, at least they admit she didn't have any training. Thank you. But then to come back and say, yeah, she's a better Jedi than Anakin or Luke. Is she even a Jedi? I mean, is she? You just wonder those things, you know? But to compare her and say she's better because she didn't have training and she could go about and do so much more just proves one thing. It proves one thing and the writing is all over the wall. It proves one thing. Are you ready? Should I speak a little slower for people in the back? <coughs> Can everyone hear me now? It proves she really is a Mary Sue. <gasps> I mean, seriously, who sits around and writes these articles? Do you just pick up a bunch of darts or maybe some mashed potatoes and throw it up against a wall full of ideas and whatever sticks? That's what you write because that's what exactly it sounds like. My goodness. And for all those people that says you just don't like women. Ah. That ain't it, Chief. That ain't it. What I can't stand is, is when you decide to constantly tear down characters that have already built themselves up just to build up your hero. It could have been Ray. It could have been Finn. It could have been that worm creature. It could have been Bubba Frick that we're going to see in the next movie. It could have been R2-D2. It could have been BB-8. It doesn't matter. You don't tear down characters to build your character up. It doesn't work that way. We can all see it. We all know what's going on. On, it's because she has no merit to do it on her own that is why you have to do that that's it end of story end of debate that's it but I still think you don't like women yeah because that's their closing argument that's their closing argument wake up people don't tear down characters to try to build yours up in your storytelling that's it. Video's over. Thank you for listening. I'm done. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. This is Drunk3PO with Geeks and Gamers. And now enjoy a special commercial. Feeling down? Has life got you down? Do you need a little pick-me-up? A big pick-me-up? Well, head on over to geeksandgamers.com and pick up your Pick Me Up merch today. Head on over to geeksandgamers.com and pick up your happy swag today. Geeks and Gamers is not responsible nor liable if you wear one of our shirts and run around your neighborhood acting like a crazy man. That's right. 
head to geeksandgamers.com. That's geeksandgamers.com today.